Okay, I'm gonna show you the most yummiest meal in very easy. Like, I can't get any more easy. Okay, I was at our local market and they had uh, pork spare ribs, like the country style spare ribs, you know, for, on sale for like $1.79 or yeah, something like that. So I was like, sweet. Jonah was excited. So, okay, what you're gonna do is open this sucker. And you're gonna literally just plop it in your crock pot like that. Voila. Okay. And now I'm gonna wash my hands. You guys had a good day? It's raining here. Very sad because I had my laundry racks right there in that space. Hanging up close this morning and um, it decided to rain. So they're now in my house drying. Boo. But yeah, it's raining here. Oh. And the mountains are already changing color. I'll have to show you another time. But yeah, fall is coming. Anywho, back to this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some barbecue sauce and I'm just gonna pour it all over. Ugh. Okay, I have two of the same bottle, so I'll end up using the other one at the end. But I'm going to cook this with the barbecue sauce. If you want to get all of it out, stick it upside down with the cap on. And then... Um, Bang it. Some more falls down. Sorry, this is a shaky video. I just realized that it's like 11.49 and this should have been in a while ago. But that's okay. Okay. Yes. Boom. All right. So I'm just gonna take this and rub it on this is one of our favorite meals. I uh, served it up for my brother when he came out here with his wife um, from North Carolina. I served this for, up for them and he was like, what, this isn't traditional ribs. Like, I want them on the grill. <laughs> but I was like, I promise you, because we went out playing that whole day. I was like, I promise you, you're gonna love these. And he does, he loves them now. So this is just an easier method if you don't want to do it on the grill. Okay, I'm gonna slide that in there so the barbecue sauce can get in between okay so I'm gonna let this cook until I don't know the longer it goes the better so until we're ready to eat so it's 11:50. I don't know maybe by s oh, when Derek walks through the door maybe 6 or 6 30 we'll be eating so I'm just gonna cook this on low until then and voila I'm gonna have ribs tonight Fast, fast, fast ribs. Okay, here's our ribs. It's six o'clock. Um, they're nice and tender, but if I let them go um, a little longer, they'd fall off the bone e or fall off each other very well. But we are starving and it smells so good. So this, these are gonna be good. These are gonna be good. I'm gonna taste it. Mm, let's taste it. Oh, yum. Oh, they're great. Mm, 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 mm. So, you can either thicken up the sauce that's already in here or heat up some fresh barbecue sauce, but I'm just gonna take a spoon and pour it over the ribs. That is so happy. Sorry, I got caught sneaking <laughs> So I made my coleslaw, and I think I've already did a video on this, so. But we love eating this with coleslaw, like can't have it without it. So it's you get a bite of your ribs, you get a bite of the coleslaw. And you are in happy, 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 happy heaven. So, and then I made a salad. So this is what we're having for dinner. Ribs, coleslaw, and a green salad. So try this, let me know what you think. And if you do this, let me know how you do it. Okay, here's my plate. Here's the ribs. Oh, salad with Italian dressing and the coleslaw. Yum. Mm -hmm. Yum, yum. So, giddy up, guys. Yeah.